Uh, good afternoon, my name is Jordan Martinez. Uh, before I begin, I'd like to apologize for any stuttering, um, any, you know, things like that. I'm not really good in front of the camera, but anyways. Uh, I'm first going to begin with my, what I made for my project, how I did it, and then I'll later go on to explain a little bit about the uh, GBAM's quilters and their situation and how it relates to mine. And uh, some things I learned on the way uh, past the project. So first I chose a soda bottle as my project and I grabbed uh, a knife and some scissors and I made it into this, this string kind of thing. And then I converted that to kind of like this, this rope material. What I did, I put it into a drill uh, and then I'd spin it and it'd spin this way. It'd start turning and the tighter it, or the more it turns, the tighter it gets. And it's actually a really strong material. So I really, really liked uh, working with the bottle. Uh, but moving on, uh, some things that I experienced while doing this project was I did get a lot of cuts. I know there's a cut, there's a cut here because this is, this is really sharp. So that was something that was going on. Um, and I believe if I go over here to the questions, um, so going into the project, my vision from the beginning was from an engineering standpoint, how to make it efficient, how to get the most, you know, out of the, the resource, which was just the bottle. Um, I looked at it practically. So I thought like if I were in a position where I didn't really have much and I had to create something really practical, I ended up choosing a string. I mean, the string, you can make rope and rope is really, it's really, really strong in any survival situation or just in general uh, for anything with structures, anything rope is, rope is almost a necessity. So I went with practicality. Um, my own creativity, I mean, I went into it with a uh, a practical point of view. So just from that, I already, I think I'm pretty good going into the engineering field. So, um, let's see. So did making your project during this time of social distancing and self quarantine impact you emotionally? Um, it actually, it, it did because I don't really, don't really talk to too many people around my area anymore. Uh, everyone just went to college and I'm doing online college for you. So, I think it just sort of gave me some time to reflect and think about what I'm going to do for the future. And this was happening while I was making the project. So it gave me a lot of time to think for myself and I really liked it. In conclusion, I decided to make a rope, not only because it was practical, um, but also because for me, I like to use rope as a symbol for unity and how unified the G-Bone quilters were during this time uh, which was everything was it was depicted in the quilts themselves that uh, everyone built everyone tried to be unified everybody tried to make it out together after you know escaping slavery so I think um, all in all it was a great project I enjoyed it a lot um, but yeah that was my presentation thank you